Howdy everybody. This is a tutorial to resize the second monitor for a TV. Um, it's a common problem that TV manufacturers will cut down the image just slightly um, to make it look better on the TV. But that doesn't always work if you want to duplicate your laptop or computer monitor over because then it cuts off things like the taskbar and the top of web pages and stuff like that. So we're going to fix that. What you're going to need to do is right click on the desktop and go to graphics properties and then display. This will give you a bunch of settings. We're only interested in the display for the second monitor, which in this case is a Panasonic TV. I have it set to 1080p res resolution. Um, set it try to set it to whatever resolution the TV is. And then we want customize aspect ratio. Sometimes this setting may not show up. So you may need to decrease the resolution to make it show up. Um, 720p, 1280 by 720 is another common resolution. Um, if you decrease it to that, then it should work fine. Um, what we can do is we can maintain the display scaling, which will make the image larger than the screen is. If we customize aspect ratio, normally it will be default like 100% here. What you're going to do is you're going to look at the TV screen as you decrease these settings. You want to decrease them so that they're always the same number. Um, you might try 90 or 89. That's what I happen to fall on. And then see if the screen will still fit. If that doesn't work, go down to 80. And then follow this course of action until you find that you have a black, a black rectangle around the image on the TV. At that point, you'll increase it by a couple until it fits perfectly. So for me, I happened to go, I went down to 70. And there was a black bar around on the actual TV screen, the physical TV screen. And then I went up to 75. And there are still a couple of pixels around it. And I went up to 76. And that seemed to work perfectly for me. It will be different for every different TV. Uh, for every different TV model, it may be different depending on your laptop model. Um, just change these until it fits. And they should always be the same number, otherwise the image will be distorted, stretched either vertically or horizontally, and you don't want that. Um, a lot of these other settings you don't want to mess with too much. Refresh rate should be 60p, rotation should be zero. The only thing that you're worried about is making sure that you can see all of your screen on your TV. And this is how you do that. So I think that's it. Thank you for watching.